But on Monday, we'll be finally filling the studio with some festive cheer when we put up our decoration. And about time too, I say. Absolutely. So stand by for plenty of Christmas films from around the country. Uh, tonight is different as we look at how people of other faiths, and indeed no faith at all, celebrate the holiday season. I'm Ariane. And I'm Graham. And, and we're, we're atheists. atheists. I'm Nasser, and I'm an imam. We're the Sungu family, and we're British Sikh. I'm Kate, and I'm a Wiccan High Priestess. I am Nisha, and I am Hindu. I'm Cheetah, and I'm a Buddhist man. I'm Debbie. And I'm Nathan. And we're, we're rabbis. As a Muslim, I personally look forward to Christmas. I feel that Christmas is the only opportunity as a country that we have to breathe and think about life. A chance for us to meet my neighbours um, and just be happy and uh, I think it's something which transcends religions. Um, for the past three years I've been invited by my local church to come and take part in the Christmas service where I've been asked to read parts of the Bible from the Old Testament. It's taken me out of my comfort zone as a Muslim and placed me into a congregation of Christians and to be part of something that's really important for them that's become very special for me and I think it's a relationship which has really grown and helped us as a community. As a reformed Jew, Christmas is a lovely time of year but it's not a religious celebration in any way. As an Orthodox Jew, celebrating Christmas is more of watching the Christmas experience from, from afar. We just did eight days of Hanukkah and by that point we're pretty much done our holidays for the winter year. And last year was actually especially nice because Hanukkah coincided with Christmas, so after we'd enjoyed our turkey and our Hanukkah pudding and watched the Queen's speech, we could uh, light the Hanukkah together and, and celebrate that way. And the dreidels a bit as well. <laughs> I guess I kind of embrace it really just as a cultural phenomenon. It's traditionally a celebratory time of year, but that in itself can bring its own um, sense of expectation that we um, should be happy. It kind of almost highlights what about our life we maybe feel is lacking. I think it's good to remember that others are suffering and develop that mind of compassion. Just because we're not Christian doesn't mean that we can't celebrate love and togetherness and family, because all these things are universal. Uh, you don't need to go to church to do that. You don't need to pray to do that. Ariane started buying Christmas decorations in September. Advent calendars and snow globes and sparkly things. And I even like Christmas carols. I started whacking on the music the other day, didn't I? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now, Christmas tree has been a tradition uh, whenever I was a child in India growing up. We've put our Christmas tree up on Christmas Eve and then it will be Santa time. I love cooking the traditional Christmas dinner, but with a little bit of twist, and that twist is with loads of spices. But Christmas, in my opinion, has become too commercialized, and it has to be brought back to its spiritual roots of being loving, kind, and humble to each other. As Wiccans, we don't really celebrate Christmas as much as we celebrate Yule, at the winter solstice, some days before Christmas. Yule heralds the promise of the onset of spring. Many of the traditions of Yule resemble those of Christmas. We gather around with friends and we celebrate with feasting and song and dance. We have the Yule log on the fire and we have the chocolate log on the table. So whereas for Christians, Christmas is the celebration of the birth of the Son of God. Wiccans and pagans celebrate the rebirth of the sun, which brings light and warmth and fire to the land. As a British Sikh family, the way we view Christmas is not necessarily on a spiritual or a religious level, but more of a cultural festivity. With the kids, um, Christmas starts from the day they open the advent calendar on the 1st of December. My favourite thing about Christmas is when I open up my presents, giving and sharing. We not only have the advent calendars, we actually put up the Christmas tree and the Christmas decorations, so they're very excited. <laughs> Yuletide blessings to all. Have, have a, a happy, happy atheist, atheist Christmas. Christmas. Sabko Shub Christmas. Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas and a Hanukkah, Hanukkah Sameach. Christmas Mubarak to everyone. Have a very peaceful Christmas. Christmas well, thanks very much to everybody who took part in that film, and we are getting a tinsel down from the attic the minute we are off air.